In the vast landscape of spiritual and philosophical literature, few works resonate as deeply as the writings of Carlos Castaneda. Drawn from his personal experiences as an apprentice under the enigmatic shaman Don Juan Matus, Castaneda introduced the world to a new dimension of consciousness, challenging our conventional beliefs and pushing the boundaries of what we consider reality. But beyond the allure of mysticism and tales of sorcery, the teachings of Don Juan hold profound relevance even today, especially in our fast-paced, often disorienting modern world. These teachings aren't just esoteric principles reserved for the spiritual elite. They are practical guidelines, tools we can wield to navigate life's challenges with greater clarity, purpose, and inner peace. As we delve into this exploration, let's uncover the three barriers, as illuminated by Don Juan through Castaneda's writings, that often stand in our way, preventing us from living our fullest, most authentic lives. But first, let us learn what these barriers are keeping us from seeing. The power of perception. Our daily existence, with its routines, relationships, and challenges, often feels concrete and immutable, as if this is the only way life can be. Yet, beneath this facade, lies a myriad of possibilities, countless interpretations of reality that our conditioned minds often fail to grasp. Every moment, every interaction, every thought we entertain is but one perspective in a vast ocean of potential perceptions. Don Juan emphasized this by introducing Castaneda to the art of seeing. But this wasn't about physical sight. It was about perceiving the world beyond the conventional, beyond the layers of societal conditioning and personal biases. Seeing, in Don Juan's teachings, is an act of piercing through the commonplace interpretations of life to experience the underlying energy, the essence that constitutes all of existence. By broadening our perception, we aren't just expanding our view of the world. We are unlocking doors to uncharted dimensions of experience and understanding. We begin to realize that our current perceptions, no matter how firm they seem, are flexible, adaptable, and subject to change. This shift can empower us to confront life's adversities with newfound clarity and to engage with our surroundings in more enriching, meaningful ways. Now, let's delve deeper into the barriers that limit our perception. Stick with us to the end as we invite you on the warrior's path challenging the very barriers that are keeping you from living a life of purpose and intent. Self-importance as a barrier. Navigating the complexities of life, we often find ourselves at the heart of our own stories, interpreting the world through a highly personalized lens. This inclination to position ourselves centrally is a manifestation of our deep-rooted sense of self-importance. Yet, as we learn to diminish this sense of self-centeredness, we discover the doorway to true freedom, an existence where we remain unfazed by external influences, navigating the world with a serene equanimity. Don Juan, through Castaneda's recounts, paints a vivid picture of the perils of being dominated by this self-centric view. As he poignantly expressed, think about it. What weakens us is feeling offended by the deeds and misdeeds of our fellow men. Our self-importance requires that we spend most of our lives offended by someone. This profound insight underscores the chains we unwittingly bind ourselves with when every action, word, or perceived slight becomes a direct affront to our self-worth. To step away from excessive self-importance isn't a journey into self-devaluation, but rather an expansive leap into a more inclusive worldview. It's about realizing our interconnectedness within the grand tapestry of existence and recognizing that our individual tales are but threads amidst countless others. As we shift our gaze from this limiting self-focus, we open doors to deeper connections, broader empathy, and a richer, more holistic understanding of the world around us. The limitations of routine. In the rhythm of our daily lives, Routines offer a comforting predictability, a structured dance we know all too well. They provide order amidst chaos, granting us a semblance of control. However, 
While routines can indeed be a haven of comfort, they can equally become chains that confine, limiting our experiences and narrowing our worldview. But it's essential to understand that Don Juan isn't just referencing our daily routines. He is, perhaps more critically, pointing towards ingrained mental patterns that shape our responses and actions, modes like complaining, constant skepticism, or perpetual defensiveness. Carlos Castaneda, under the tutelage of Don Juan, is repeatedly shown how his predictability, rooted in these persistent behavioral patterns, obstructs his vision of the full spectrum of reality, keeping him ensnared within a confining cage. Don Juan's teachings underscore the significance of challenging and re-evaluating these self-imposed structures. It's through transcending our habitual patterns that we can truly open ourselves to a kaleidoscope of new experiences and perspectives. This path leads to a more profound comprehension of the world and our unique place within its vast tapestry. It's not about completely abandoning all routines, but about not being defined or constrained by them. By consciously choosing to diverge from the routine, even occasionally, we create opportunities for personal growth and freedom, inviting us to embrace life in all its unpredictable, ever-changing splendor. Liberating from personal history. Each of us holds a narrative shaped by memories, experiences, and choices. While these narratives offer context and grounding, they can also limit our actions and tether us to outmoded self-concepts. Being overly attached to our personal history turns it into a restricting weight, sometimes protective, but often hindering our full engagement with life. In the teachings of Don Juan, erasing personal history emerges as a technique to untether oneself from the confines of past narratives and self-imposed limitations. This act isn't about neglecting one's past, but rather viewing it without attachment or self-pity, which otherwise clouds perception and traps us in redundant cycles. Don Juan asserts that the relentless attachment to our personal tales obstructs true freedom and growth. By erasing our personal history, we create a pathway to avoid the trap of self-pity, which originates from an inflated sense of self-importance. This change also encourages us to assume responsibility, a fundamental trait of living like a warrior. This warrior's path guides us away from the familiar, allowing our consciousness to evolve and expand. Over time, as we distance ourselves from the known, our internal dialogue begins to quieten. As Don Juan emphasizes, this silence is the gateway to the sorcerer's realm. The Path of the Warrior In the teachings of Don Juan, a concept emerges that stands as a beacon for those seeking true transformation, the Path of the Warrior. This isn't about physical battles, but an inner journey, a commitment to facing life with courage, purpose, and unwavering intent. The warrior isn't bound by societal norms or the opinions of others, but chooses a life of authenticity, guided by inner wisdom and a profound connection to the universe. To genuinely walk Don Juan's path, specific guidelines are essential. Using death as a close advisor emphasizes life's fleeting nature, heightening our intentionality and drive. The act of stalking oneself becomes vital urging introspection into our behaviors and thoughts. Through such self-awareness and confronting our limitations, we nurture the warrior's spirit, enabling decisive and purposeful action. This path calls for fluidity, for being like water, adapting to situations while retaining one's essence. Embracing challenges not as burdens, but as opportunities for growth, the warrior understands that stagnation is antithetical to life's very nature. Instead of resisting change, they welcome it, using each twist and turn as a stepping stone in their continuous evolution. By adopting the mindset of the warrior, we align ourselves with a force greater than any external circumstance. We become agents of our own destiny, living each moment with clarity, purpose, and an unwavering commitment to our authentic selves.
As we come to the close of this exploration, it becomes evident that the teachings of Don Juan, as conveyed through the writings of Carlos Castaneda, aren't just intriguing tales from a distant culture. They are profound insights, applicable to our everyday lives, offering us tools for transformation and paths to inner freedom. Life, with its myriad experiences and challenges, constantly beckons us to grow, to evolve, and to transcend our perceived limitations. The wisdom of Don Juan serves as a compass, guiding us through this intricate maze of existence, encouraging introspection and fostering a deeper connection to our authentic selves. For those who felt a resonance with these teachings, let this be but the beginning of your journey. Dive deeper into Castaneda's works and let the rich tapestry of his experiences with Don Juan further illuminate your path. As you embark on this quest of self-discovery, remember that every step, every challenge, and every moment of revelation is a part of the beautiful dance of life. Embrace it, learn from it, and let it shape you into the best version of yourself.